What does this mean? First of all, what language? This is in Cambodian. I tell you, I haven't done too many uh, Cambodian, like maybe not a lot, you know? That's Tattoos. just fun to say that word, Cambodian. Cambodian. <laughs> <laughs> it's my middle name, which is Tita. All of this whole thing is your middle name? It's, it means angelic princess. So if you were to spell out your whole name, your whole side would be done probably, right? How's it feel, right? Yeah, it does not hurt as much as I thought it would at all. Thank God. Hi, my name's Katie. I'm an apprentice under Tony. I'm Ian McLennan. I'm from MassArt. My name's Perry, and I'm a local from Boston. I'm Eric. I'm a student at the Art Institute of Boston. I think what Tony's doing is a really great idea. I think Tony's doing this because he really wants to see the students get their art seen. There's so much talent in the schools, but there's no way for them to get seen. So what he's doing is he's opening up his entire studio for people to bring in their art and get it sold, or at least even seen. I think it's a great opportunity for students to get their art out. It's a great way to like bring art to the community, bring it back to everybody, you know, and everybody be a part of it as well. Something more different than what's already out there. You get to go see beautiful art by local students and people that love art, and you can get a tattoo and other accommodations. Everybody's going to really enjoy it and love it. All right. I cannot believe that Tony's doing this. He's just opening up a whole new door for these students and it's just such a great thing to see. Oh, it's huge. It's absolutely huge. 6,000 square feet. It's 30 foot ceilings. Right now it's completely... It's, 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 it's demolished. It's been sitting there for 15 years. Hobos and bombs and stuff been like sneaking in and defecating everywhere and sleeping in there and it's disgusting so it needs a complete demo in order, you know, in order for the Board of Health and everything. It's a tattoo shop so obviously it has to be completely, uh, you, know, sank, you know, clean and stuff like that so that's why where all the money comes in, you know. It's gonna cost a lot of money to, re to redo this whole entire place. My main thing is the art gallery. That's mostly that's going to be the main thing. When somebody, when, when you guys walk in here, you're going to see just art everywhere you look, from from all the local colleges and all the art schools and stuff. I want all those kids to have their art like hanging everywhere you look. And I'm not even charging them a commission to put up their work. You know what I mean? It's all free. You free? Free? You're not going to believe this, but there's a movie theater already in it because it was a recording studio. So in the back, there was there's a a movie theater and it's a recording booth and also a theater screen that's already in there that I don't plan on taking out. I, I just want a little everything inside this, this 6,000 square feet. I just want a little everything to be in there. And it's not to make money. I mean, you know, obviously it's gonna, it's, it's, it's more than just one form of art, this is drawing or painting. You know, there's so many different. So I think it'd be awesome, to, especially in the city, in the middle of freaking Boston. That's, yeah. That's the whole idea, right there in a nutshell. <laughs> Eight, ten years old, I used to just draw like Garfield and He-Man and all the time. <laughs> when I was a little kid, and, you know, I didn't do that great in school, so obviously all I did in school was draw. I kind of grew up like um, around that, like the biker scene. So there's a lot of bikies around me, and they, I, I guess they, they could say that they got me into actually tattooing, you know? Yeah, I just got better at it, and self-taught, and just did it for years. 13 years now, almost 14. Then they legalized it in mass in 2000. And I just went off, you know? Freaking love it. I don't, even, I don't even call it work. I don't even consider it work. I don't get up and go, I'm going to work today. I, I, I just get up and go, I'm going to draw on people <laughs> today. <laughs> you know? What are we missing? No, I'm not. She's like, how long? Thank you, feel good? Alright? Yeah, I feel good. Not bad, right?